some of the unique challenges to women in the animal protection field, um, as well as you know, people, veterinarians as well, I mean, we're drawn to the work because we're passionate about the issue generally. And I think that passion can fuel us and it also is ripe for burnout because we push, push, push. And, you know, it's the, it, and I see, and doing some research into statistics around burnout, burnout is very high in um, animal protection field. And I just learned from someone this morning who's uh, with the Suicide Prevention, American Association of Suicide Prevention, that suicide among animal protection workers ranks, uh, is in alignment with police officers and firefighters, which is a huge wake up call. So it's um, trying to find some of those unique challenges for women as caretakers uh, or people, and I'm not even sure if it's just women, but people who enter a caretaking profession, which is veterinarians, you know, animal protection workers, nurses, and there's some alignment to the human uh, side of healthcare as well, are drawn to the work and then we continue to take care, take care, but we're not taking care of ourselves. And so how do we start working on self-care? So those are some of the issues that I think um, are unique to women.